Hey guys, Aaron Edgar here. I just got back from seeing the sugar with Intronaut and unfortunately not animals as leaders. Drove 26 hours to see the show and they couldn't make it across the border. A little bit pissed. That's honestly part of the reason that I wanted to go. I've seen Meshuggah twice already. This was number three. And of course they destroyed, so I don't feel ripped off or anything, but I really wanted to see animals as leaders. Anyway, that's not really the point of this video. I wanted to actually just publicly announce something that I haven't said yet. Uh, I've officially left my endorsement with Hammer Axe. I am no longer with them as an artist. Uh, there's no, like, weirdness or hard feelings or anything like that. We were just both kind of evolving in different ways. Like, the things that I needed were not the things that they were starting to make. So I will say this, I am going to be going for new symbols, and the key here is versatility. I need a cymbal company that's going to cover all the bases. I need something that's going to work for really heavy music and be able to cut through anything. I need stuff that's going to be dark, expressive, and trashy. And I also need weird stuff. As you guys know, I, I like things that aren't normal. So I need a company that's innovative and extremely versatile. I'm not looking at a small company. It's going to be a big company. And uh, I will leave it at that. You guys can make guesses or suggestions, whatever you want, in the comments below. I will say that I'm pretty close to having already chosen, but I'm not going to say who yet. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. And uh, just to say another thing too, is like I know I've been very, very against drum covers for the entirety of the time I've been on YouTube, but I actually might do one or two coming up. Maybe. No promises, but it might happen. So, yeah, something to maybe look forward to. You guys probably saw the last video I uploaded was me... Uh, Edgarizing a drum fill from a periphery song. And uh, in case you didn't know where that was from, it's from Icarus Lives. It's about a minute and 34 seconds in. It's right after that section where the drums cut out. It's the fill out of that. I just kind of made it a little more me. So, yeah. I will see you guys inside the next video. And I'm very excited to start working with some new sounds. It's going to be inspiring, and I think it'll change the way I play a little bit. Because as we all know, with different gear, you approach things differently. So... This could be very cool to see what happens in the near future with my plane. Bye, guys.